everyone, and of course, always all tabs me. And welcome back to another episode of To the Moon. Woo! Bringing it back. All right, I'm loving it. So let's head on into file t one. File one. Almost at file two. Not too much time left in this. Ooh, let's see what's going on down here. What the heck are you doing in there, dude? What? Asked her out? No, that was blah blah blah. I didn't read what it said. If I were you, I would just buzz in there and be all like, "Hey, you, go out, me, you now." That's just terrible. I know, and it still would have been better than what you did. Hey, man, he got the girl. Don't worry about it. I guess we should go up to river, huh? Right. Stuff toy platypus. Well, I suppose if you look at it from the right angle. No, not really. Never mind. Cool, so it wasn't meant to. That was right. Shit! So, uh, I don't know. It's almost Christmas time, guys, and I actually kind of have a Christmas special planned out this time. I oh, know, weird, right? Oh, hello. What's she doing in the computer lab, dude? Psst! She's coming this way! I'll tap, I'll tap! Received a note. Alt tab. Wait, I want to read this. I want to read this note. This alt tab note. Lifesaver. <laughs> That's funny. Cool. I wonder if there's something in this class. Anyone? Oh, is the river gonna say it? Anyone at all? Dots. Alright then. River, why don't you answer it? I know you know the answer. We're waiting, River. We all know you got it. You're the smart kid. He made sail on August 3rd of 1492 from the Spanish city of Palos, Le <laughs> Palos de la Frontera, which was founded in 1322 and granted to Alva Perez de Guzman. <laughs> de Guzman. De Guzman! I love that name. Was it the merge of age 14 by the... Okay, okay, only ask for the date. But see, was that so hard? Cool, so that was a memento. Good lord, does everyone with her condition have nearly photographic memory? Not really. Though I think their road memory is often fairly strong. Cool, so that's the memory for this area. There's got to be something in that room up there. <laughs> Let's head on in. Locked! Wait, what does it say? Cafeteria, only open during lunch hours. Oh, so we gotta make it lunch hours. Okay, well, let's go over here first. Where are we at? Ooh, gym class. Sweet. That's a wrap. You chumps better, mm, better next time. And atrium. We could use this place later. I just can't believe that these court lines are rectangles in his head. <laughs> Instead of round. That's kind of funny how they're playing off the game a little bit. Oh, what's up here? Anything? There's a piano. Oh, that piano might come in useful. Hmm, okay. So apparently we might use this place. Wait, whoa. Requires four bars of memory links to proceed. Oh, shit. Touch him. Touch it. Dude, can you touch this guy, please? Thank you. Do him push ups. Ugh. Fine, you win. That's how I feel when doing push ups. Ugh. JK. I actually like working out quite a bit. I still can't believe it's like three days till Christmas. Or not, not even three days. It's two days right now. Not to date this recording, but I'm dating this recording. It's the 23rd. It's just crazy. It'll probably go up on the 23rd too, but you know. Um, and like I said, I will have a little bit of a Christmas special for you guys. I'm pretty excited for it, actually. I think you guys are going to really like it. Yeah, she's unique, but she's uniquely boring. What? River's the bomb. Are they talking about River? Oh, no. River's awesome. You shut your little whore mouth, you. You little slut. She just sits there by herself all day with that creepy deformed duck toy. It's a platypus, you fucking asshole. See? He knows it's a platypus. What the heck's a platypus? Quit making words up. They're real. Anyway, she's just so 
off, you know? It's not her fault she has a disorder, you ass. I know, isn't that cool? It is cool! Maybe he is into aliens. Why don't you just go with the emos and goths? Well, for one, I don't want to ruin my hair. <laughs> the fact that we got a name for them says a lot, too. Look, Nick. It's just... Or, I just... I just don't want to be another typical kid in a sea of typical people. Well, how the heck would being with her change your own identity? I mean, you'd just be some guy who hangs out with a shy girl. She's not just shy, Nick. There's something strange about her. Being strange isn't always a good thing, you know? Do you even know if she wants to be different? Maybe she just wants to fit in like everyone else. And if she does, pushing her the other way wouldn't help, would it? Look, Nick, the point is, I know what I need. And she's the one who has it. So you want her for what she has, but not for her? Wait, whoa, 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 that is cold. I just hope you know what you're doing. I do. I think you're wrong, though. People aren't that typical. Everyone's unique in some way. That's just what grandmas tell you. Ooh, I'm a Nick on that one, man. That's pretty cold there. Is he just using her? Sometimes, sorry, I was taking a drink of coffee. That's my bad. You know, sometimes I want to slap our clients upside the head. It's high school. Everyone's a bastard. But hey, welcome to the club. Wait, so this is what he told her about at the cliff? <gasps> oh, I think it was. I suppose so. She then went cuckoo and began to make those creepy rabbits, right? Because he can invest this... From who knows how long ago. I guess she's pretty good at holding a grudge. And the rabbits she made were... All the white ones were just typical people, quote unquote. And the blue and yellow one was supposed to be her. Something feels missing. Then go get a hat, Sherlock. Come on. I think a passport's leaning against the table there. I think you're right. I need one more memento, though. Do you have it? I'm envious that this kid was still here to help him move pianos when their hair grew white. I wish I was still in contact with my childhood friends. Yeah, I'm still somewhat in contact with my friends from high school. Um, met a lot of new people since I moved, though. Let's go talk to River. Stuffed toy platypus. I just love how every time we see this thing, we're guaranteed a free memory link. <laughs> Must have left a big scar on his mind as it did on mine. Damn. I actually think the stuffed platypus is kind of cool. I kind of want a stuffed platypus. That'd be sweet, dude. Should I even? No need. I'm all good now. Um. Oh my gosh. If you guys saw Fantastic... Come here! Oh, for what? I don't want to say... Come here! I'm doing it. Hey! Aw, oh, not cool, Eva. Never, f never cock block someone in the middle of Kamehameha. True! God, I'm gonna do it. Anyway. Ha! Okay, I did it. I, I feel, I feel better now. This episode is definitely gonna be called Kamehameha. For sure, if I can remember to call it that. Sweet, let's prepare the memento. I hope nobody gets mad at me for yelling in my dorm room. Uh, let's do this. Fuck, did I just hit the wrong one? God, which one did I hit? Did I hit this one? Change that back. Do this. Now do this. This. No, shit. I meant that, and then that. I had the right idea, I just kept clicking the wrong ones on accident. That's cool. It's, it's totally cool. Sweet. Let's pass on through. Damn, this guy's turning out to be a little colder than I thought. 
don't know. I feel like by the end, though, he definitely grew out of that. And that's why he confessed it to her. Because, I mean, he was just being honest. And I have a lot of respect for that. I think he truly loved River. I'm going to school now, Mom. Have a nice day, Joey. My baby boy. Growing up so fast. I think... I think Joey here... I don't know, I feel like at first that was kind of his intention, was to, you know, use her to stand out. Ack, what if he was a girl? Would he still make a nickname? Would he? Would she still nickname him after his grandpa? Probably not. Wouldn't be that bad, actually, since it ended in EY. Joey, Jewy, Julie, sounds cute. If it sounds so cute, then why don't you marry him? Ah, uh, jealous? Oh yes, yeah, so jealous. Yeah, Dr. Watt, why don't you marry him? He he he. Well, to be fair, ticking clock is pretty annoying indeed. Cool, so we got that. I want to go in there. Search that. I don't know what that is. Ow! What even is that? I don't even know what that is. Alright, cool. Um, his mom is obviously going to be one, right? Or the- Oh! Pickled olives! I wonder if he took that in his life. Oh, blah. Not again. Oh! Pickled cucumbers? Holy crap! My mind's totally both. <laughs> You're pretty easily impressed. I- Mine is too? Cucumbers! That's crazy. Yes, the couch is a memento. Wonderful. The last one's probably in here. It's probably... On the bookshelf, apparently. Read the books. Find a cool one? Various books. Oh, Animorphs! Oh, I thought it was going to be Animorphs in there. I was hoping for Animorphs. Alright, let's go crack open this memento. Memento! Oh god, I need to like sniffle or something. My nose is feeling super clogged. Oh, I hope you guys can't hear that. Oh, it sounds so gross. I feel gross now. All right. So, we will travel through this memento in the next episode. Oh, man. I bet you guys are upset about that. Leaving you on a cliffhanger like this. Oh, boy. Can't wait to see you guys all in the next one. Love y'all. And I'll catch you later. Bye.